Another beautiful Sunday afternoon here in Washington in February. Nice. Hey everybody, the Big W here. Well, it's been a little bit since I've seen you, a couple weeks. So I thought I'd give you just a little update on what's been going on. That last little trip that I took up the road to Yale Lake and up in there, up in the mountainous area, uh, took its toll on the on the Baja bug. So uh, a few things happened and almost all of it has gotten fixed. Well, here's a couple of the problems. I told you I was shifting a lot and what happened is it finally just gave up. The shifting rod shaft here split. This is brass and the shifting ball came off of it. So all these little, it's splined. All these little splines have, have worn out over time and it just fell apart. So I went, when I fo was uh, filming the elk, I went to put it back in gear, it wouldn't go. It just sat there and floated and floated around. So what I did is I was able to feel around and push down on it I, and I was able to hold it in place on this these two pieces together until I got home and I couldn't find a good enough used one there was also a empty uh, plate in there so it made it a short shift pattern um, the other thing that happened is this had vibrated and pretty much just about fell in my lap over the over the period of time the, the mounts on it, it looked like they had been re-glued in a couple of places. It just fell apart. So my steering wheel was not in that great a shape. So I went and changed things. So what you got is a new 15 inch empty steering wheel, an adapter, and a new shifter without the quick shift plate in there. And new, I went and got new bolts for it too. So now, it works a whole lot better and uh, shifts good and I like this new steering wheel it's not so bulky I didn't like that big old thing in the middle there yeah a couple of the other things that I discovered was uh, even when I got the car well over a year ago year and a half almost two years now the uh, front master the master cylinder was leaking a little bit it would leak down out of the reservoir and uh, I would it would take it several weeks but I would lose my fluid and uh, I was hearing noises in the back uh, I couldn't decipher how bad it was but the guy when I bought the car gave me the new parts the new master cylinder and new axle bearings inner and outer so not having a lot of time I went and got some help and uh, so the brake system has been totally gone through all new axle bearings all new axle boots um, everything back there it's all been redone now so now she's back the way it should be so uh, some of the other things I've been doing is uh, when I went to buses by the bridge I got those banners and I've been reworking on the garage. I uh, put two new LED fixtures in here. What a difference in lighting that made. It just made a whole, whole lot of difference. And this looks pretty good. Yeah, you go from a light fixture like this, just a standard porcelain with a LED 60 watt bulb in it basically to those and they had quite a, an illuminating difference and uh, I got my toolboxes in place and this uh, the bigger one needs to be repainted I got it for free just for going and getting it so and I built this shoe rack here in the garage out of spare parts and it's all mounted to the wall so I can get rid of some some other excess and unpack some more boxes just a couple little goodies there. Yeah, I'm liking my banners. And these are, 
these are lithographs from PPG paint. Yeah, all while I'm talking to you, this is what it's doing outside. It's been doing this. It, it snowed yesterday and then it all melted. Now and it's doing it again today. Well, I guess I better get in there and get some more work done while I got a chance. Don't think I'm going much of any place. So uh, I appreciate you guys coming by and watching and commenting. Those of you that have subscribed, I really appreciate it all. Go out there and have a great and wonderful day today. And we'll catch you later. This is Big W.